Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. 380 sheriffs in 40 states just issued orders to Congress on behalf of President Trump. Is Donald Trump alone in his push to build the wall? His opponents say yes and portray him as racist and bigoted for pushing this issue. An announcement from a major group, however, makes it clear that the president isn't the only one who believes the southern wall is important, and the people who are urging Congress to secure the border know a few things about law enforcement. Earlier this month, a stunning 380 sheriffs from 40 different states signed a joint letter calling on lawmakers to fund the U.S.-Mexico wall and finally secure America's borders. Without border security and immigration reform, more Americans will continue to be victims of crime. Now is the time to act, declared the letter, which was drafted by the National Sheriffs Association. That group is one of the largest law enforcement associations in the country and is made up of over 20,000 members, 3,000 of whom serve as sheriffs. As elected sheriffs, we have taken an oath to do everything in our power to keep our citizens and legal residents, our communities, and our nation safe, the letter stated. Year after year, we have been warning the federal government about detrimental increases in transnational drug trafficking, gang violence, sex trafficking, murder, and other escalating incidents of crime by illegal aliens entering our country, continued the law enforcement professionals. Those officers called out Washington lawmakers for failing to act and putting the American people at risk. Because Congress has failed to enact the necessary reforms, our citizens and legal residents face even greater dangers. Our national security is more vulnerable, and our enforcement efforts have been seriously compromised. The 380 sheriffs jointly stated. Senators and representatives weren't the only ones scolded by the sheriffs. Liberal sanctuary city policies, such as the ones becoming widespread on the West Coast, were also pointed to as a source of problems for American citizens. These sanctuary policies, including the laws California enacted, directly undermine and limit cooperation and collaboration between local, state and federal law enforcement, making it harder for America's sheriffs to protect our citizens and legal residents, the law enforcement officials explained. In addition, the problem of MS-13 and other gangs that operate back and forth across our borders has become worse because of our failure to secure the border and the continued court-ordered catch and release policies. We've reported on the results of those policies many times. Left-leaning cities and counties routinely work against federal ICE agents, essentially aiding criminals who often return to commit more crimes. When hundreds of veteran law enforcement officers from across America come together to warn citizens about the consequences of an unsecured border, it may be time to listen. Illegal immigration is not just an Arizona or California issue. It has widespread effects throughout America, and the consequences of inaction are all too often deadly. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.